Hey guys, welcome back to my channel that is still a learner. In this video, we are going to talk about third class EVS last chapter that is chapter number 11 workbook answers and the name of our lesson is this is the way. Okay, let's see it. So, first of all, we have given grocery which means synonyms or meanings. Okay, so these are all the synonyms which you need to buy hard your kids. Okay, first one is direction which means east, west, north, south. So, these are all the directions. Next corner, okay. The place between any two directions, okay. Next neighbor, place living in the houses or other buildings near our house. Next neighborhood, the area around our house. Next landmarks, well-known places in a particular area. Next symbols, representation of landmarks. Next maps, the pictorial information of areas. Next, compass. A device is used to find direction. Okay, these are all the meanings. Next, first worksheet. Let's see. So, here, this is taken from the concept introduction. Find the way. So, this is the puzzle you need to make your kids to do by themselves. Okay, in and out is given. So, you need to draw a dotted line from in to out. Okay, without any distractions. Okay, let's move on to the worksheet number 2. This has taken from the concept, where is uncle's house? Okay, so first Roman, we have given some words. We need to rewrite the following given words. Okay, and one thing you must make sure that first letter should be capital in each word. Okay, so first one is uncle, next house, next neighborhood, next comfortable, next one is neighbors okay let's move on to the second roman of the same worksheet which is fill in the blanks okay here some fill in the blanks are given we need to answer it so the first question is the area around our house is our neighborhood okay second one people living in these houses are our neighbors third one every neighborhood has dash and make our lives okay comfortable which is few facilities okay Let's move on to the third Roman. Here, question and answers are given. We need to answer each question. Okay. Let's see the first question. What must be there around a house? Answer is colleges, hostels, hospitals, income tax offices. Okay. Let's see the second question, which is who are our neighbors? Answer teachers, doctors. Okay, third question is, what is meant by neighborhood? Answer is, the people living around our house are called neighborhood. Fourth one, name your neighbors. Okay, here you need to write down the name of your neighbors. Here I have written just three names. Okay, if you want, you can just copy paste the same or else you just change it according to your wish. Okay, answer is Ravi, Jyoti and Karan. Okay, guys, these are all the question and answers. Let's move on to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 3. Okay, guys, it is taken from the concept facilities available in your neighborhood and knowing sites. Okay, and you need to write down the date also on which date you are just entering this worksheet. So, here in the first Roman, we have given some words. We need to rewrite the following words again by placing the first letter as capital. So, the very first word is facilities. So, facilities. Second one is front. Third one, black. Fourth one, left. And fifth one is right. So, let's move on to the second Roman. Here, some pictures are given. Okay. And at the same time, brackets also given. Now, what you have to do? Pick the facilities available in your neighborhood. Okay. Just see the pictures and you need to tick out which facility is available in your neighborhood. If it is available, just put the tick mark or else just leave it empty. Okay. So, first one is neighborhood. So, I have put tick mark because everyone has a neighborhood. Okay. So, like this, you just put uh, take out whatever facility you have or else just leave it. Let's move on to the next Roman that is third Roman. Here some blanks boxes are given and we need to fill it with an appropriate information. So suppose your home is the middle part. Okay. What is there in front of your house? If it is there is another house just write down house. Okay. Like this you have to uh, 
प्लेस वॉट एवर यू हैव फ्रंट बैक राइट एंड लेफ्ट मीन्स फोर डिरेक्शन वॉट एवर यू हैव यू जस्ट प्लेस इट मीन्स यू जस्ट राइट इट डाउन देर ओके सो आफ्टर दैट वील मूव टू द नेक्स्ट वन हियर वॉट इज देर इन फ्रंट ऑफ यूर हाउस आंसर इज देर इज एन अदर हाउस इन फ्रंट ऑफ माई हाउस और अवर हाउस ओके सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इज वॉट डू यू फाइंड एट द बैक ऑफ यूर हाउस आंसर इज A sweet shop is there at the back of our house. Third one, what do you observe to the right side of your house? Answer is there is a hospital. Fourth one, what do you see to the left side of your house? Answer, there is a college. Okay, guys, no need to write down the same whatever I have written. Just write it down according to a wish means according to your uh. neighborhood okay so it's better actually we all have the houses surrounding our house right so it's better to write down like this only okay okay guys let's move on to the next roman that is roman number 4 which is here list out the facilities that you would like to have in your neighbors neighborhood okay here what you have to write you have to write down what facilities you would like to have in your neighborhood here i have pick up four which i would like to have in my neighborhood that is first one is colleges second one hospitals third one hotels and fourth one is offices okay if you want you just write down the same if you would like to have the same facilities in your neighborhood or else you just change it according to your wish okay so let's move on to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 4 okay it is it has taken from the concept directions east west north and south here some words are given which you need to rewrite the same so first one is directions second one east third one west fourth one north fifth one south sixth one sunrise and seventh one is sunset okay these are the seven words which you need to rewrite same Okay, let's move on to the second Roman, which is draw a picture of your house and the neighborhood. So this is a student activity here in this place, particular place. You need to draw your house and your surrounding area means your neighborhood. Okay, so this is a student activity. If parents are watching, please make help your kids to draw. Okay, let's see the third Roman, which is fill in the blanks, fill the directions. Okay. in the middle your house is there just imagine okay so above is east part then opposite to east is west then right side is south and the left side is north okay so here it has just make a twist here by changing the direction according to this you need to place it correctly okay let's move on to the fourth roman which is fill in the blanks here some sentences are given which where you need to fill the blanks the sun rises in the dash we all know the answer right so the sun rises in the east then next opposite direction to the east is dash opposite to east is of course west okay so third one directions are usually calculated from dash point north point okay directions actually calculated from north point okay then fourth one is when a boy stand in front of the sun his left hand shows dash direction answer is north direction fifth one while to his right it will be dash direction if he shows his right hand then it shows south direction okay guys let's move on to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 5 concept is directions again east west north and south here also some words are given which you need to rewrite this rewrite again so first word is boundaries second one corner third one north west fourth one north east fifth one south east sixth one south west okay please make sure you have to write down each and every letter 
ओके इट शुड बी विजिबल ओके डोंट डू एनी मिस्टेक वेल राइटिंग प्लीज इफ यू वॉन्ट यू जस्ट पॉज द वीडियो एंड राइट इट डाउन ओके लेट्स मोन टू द सेकेंड रोमन विच इज answer the following questions here some questions are given we we need to answer each and every question let's see the first question what are called boundaries answer is the limits of any area are called boundaries second question what is called corner answer the place between any two directions is called corner okay for third one how many corners are there answer is there are four corners they are north east south east south west and north west okay guys let's move on to the fourth question which is what tools are used to find directions in these days answer is compass and gps here gps is nothing but means the abbreviation of gps is global positioning system okay guys now we'll move to the next roman that is roman number 3 okay guys let's see roman number 3 which is here one picture is given in that a teacher is standing beside a blackboard okay and here six directions are given eight okay first we all know north east south and west so in the middle of it south north east south west south east and north west so these are the middle of the uh, directions okay so these eight directions are there okay now what we have to do we have to observe it carefully and we need to fill it in the blanks okay here in between one column is given and corner one column is given here west north so answer how we have to write we have to write it like northwest so second one southwest next north east next south east okay let's move on to the fifth roman which is fill in the blanks so first question is nowadays we are using dash to find directions and so compass and gps gps means global positioning system okay second one is the place between any two directions is called dash a corner okay third question gps represents dash gps always represents directions okay fourth one the limits or boundaries of a building or village are called dash we call it as boundaries okay let's move on to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 6 concept is landmark system for identification of addresses on a map okay this is the concept here some words are given in the first roman we need to rewrite the same words by placing the first letter as capital first word is landmark second one symbol third one is well known place okay fourth one is near then e r next fifth one is school okay these are the five words let's see the next roman that is question and answers we need to answer the given following questions so first question is name some well known places of your village answer is girls high school panchayat office and fort etc next second one what is meant by a landmark answer a well known place to lay le- to locate the address of a home is called landmark third question write a landmark for your school answer beside panchayat office fourth question can you name two landmarks near your school near your house answer is income tax office and narayan college okay guys these are the four questions let's move to the third roman which is fill in the blanks okay so first question is the picture with symbol is known as dash answer is a map second question the well known places are called dash landmarks okay let's move to the fourth roman which is draw your village map and locate landmark on it okay 
so what you have to do this is a student activity and you need to draw it by yourself and here you have to draw a village map okay and you have to locate the landmark also on that particular village map okay guys so this is a student activity let's move on to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 7 okay concept is knowing the importance of landmarks and symbols so for in the first roman you have given three words which you need to rewrite again okay and write down very neatly so first word is park second word college okay next third word is post office okay guys let's move on to the second roman which is Draw the symbols in the given place, means in the given space and color them. Here in this table we have given some places and for the symbols we have, we have given some place. Okay, so according to the place you need to draw the symbol of that particular word. So park is there, so park symbol is this. Like that you have to uh, draw the symbol of particular word. Okay, this is the work you have to do. So, let's move on to the next part that is match the following. Here, landmarks are given in the left column and symbols are given in the right column. So, you need to write, you need to mark it correctly. So, first one is tank landmark. Okay, this is the symbol of that. Next, this is the hospital landmark. This is the symbol. Then, neighborhood so house is the symbol of that then post office its symbol is this and then school its symbol is this sorry house is the uh, house is the fifth one and school is the third one okay guys sorry for that okay now we'll move to the next worksheet that is worksheet number 8 okay so concept is improve your learning okay so in the first concept in the first roman what is this just see conceptual understanding so answer the following questions first question is name the four directions here you need to name the four directions we all know it so that is north east west and south okay guys north south east west are the four directions second question is what do you see in the four directions of your school here you need to write in the east i see there is a panchayat office in the west there is a colony in the north there is a high school and in the south there is an office okay like that you have to write next one let's move on to the next question that is question number three which is what helps us to locate an address in our village or a city? Answer is, it is easy to locate the address of the house if there is a well-known place near it. So, these well-known places are called landmarks. Okay, guys, let's move on to the second Roman, which is questioning Roman. Okay. So, the fourth question is, what questions would you like to ask your teacher to draw the map of your village by using symbols? So, answer is, to draw the map of our village by using symbols, I will ask my teacher the following questions. So, first question is, what are the symbols? Second question, what symbols we can use for different places like schools, hospitals, temples, offices, etc. Third question, what are the directions of our village? Fourth question. What is a map? Okay, these are the four questions I would like to ask to my teacher. Okay, let's move on to the next one. That is fifth question, what, which is experiments and field observation. So, fifth question is name some landmarks of your village and write to which side they are to your school. Okay, this is student activity which you have to do it by yourself. Okay, let's move on to the next one. I mean the next uh, question which is sixth question which is information skills which is a project work. This is also a student activity which you have to do by yourself. So, 
here observations are given in the first column and here items to be tabulated first one how first house second house and third house like that okay just uh, understood it and please take the help of your parents okay guys if parents are watching this please help your kids to fill this okay in the first one you have to write to which direction is a ma main door okay main door is in which direction okay next to which direction is the tap or bore well well hand pump like this okay just help them so let's move on to the next fifth roman that is drawing picture and model making here draw your house the, then color the north in red south in blue east in orange and west in green so here you need to draw your house okay after that you need to color your house okay the north part should be colored with red south part should be colored with blue east part should be colored with orange and west part should be color with green okay this is a student activity you have to do it by yourself okay let's see the eighth question which is draw your school and draw the school building and the main rooms in it okay here you need to draw the school your school okay you need to draw the school building of yours and you have to color it here you have to draw the main rooms also like headmaster room staff room library room playground like this okay everything you need to draw it carefully and you are you can color it with any color okay as you wish here because it's not mentioned here to color the particular area with this color okay like this so let's move on to the sixth roman which is appreciation so ninth question is have you ever helped someone by giving them right directions to reach their destination answer yes i have helped someone who came to our village on election duty by telling them proper landmarks to reach the school then i felt so happy okay next tenth question is how do you feel when you watch the sunrise or sunset answer i felt so happy when i watched the sunrise or sunset i used to take pictures on my father's phone because it looks so beautiful okay guys this is the two answers means ninth and tenth question you need to answer let's move on to the assessment number 11 here choose the correct answers first one is all directions are constant and are usually calculated from the dash point answer is b north point second question the limits of any area building or college are called or village are called dash boundaries here boundary spelling mistake is given just rectify it then third question the pictures with symbols is known as a dash is known as map okay let's move on to the second roman which is fill in the blanks let's say this so the first question is the area around our house is our dash so the area around our house we call it as neighborhood second one if you face the rising sun in the morning the direction of the direction in front of you is east okay next third one the full form of gps is global positioning system okay in the third roman you have given match the following you need to match it correctly here in the row in the first column symbols are given in the second column its particular name is given so you need to mark it correctly first symbol is hospital okay so answer is b second symbol is school which is c third symbol is tank overhead water tank which is a so in the fourth roman we have given draw and color draw the map of your house to school okay you need to draw a map from your house to school okay first draw the draw your house then your school and you need to draw a map like this this is a student activity so you need to draw it by yourself okay guys let's move on to the next question okay here next answer the following given questions are given so first question is what are landmarks answer answer i have written in three points so first point is it is easy to locate the address of a home if there is a well known place near it second one 
Second point, these well-known places are called landmarks. Example, in the third point, schools, hospitals, panchayat offices, etc. Next, second question is, what are there on the four directions of your house? Okay, you need to write down the four directions of your house. So, for answer is, north house is there, east hospital is there, south shop is there and west, in west we have college. So, north house, east hospital, south shop, west college. So, guys, this is the answer. This is the complete worksheet answer. I hope you all liked it. If you like it, please don't forget to hit the like button and please share if you know anyone who you think that this video will be helpful for them too. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.